Hi, I am Prakyat, a DTSE from Huawei India Research Center and welcome to Develop with HMS Core. Today, we are going to learn about interstitial ads, which is part of the Ads Kit series. And I'm going to show you the integration steps. In the last video on Ads Kit, we introduced obtaining OAID. If you want to watch this video, please click on the link in the description below. Huawei AdSkit uses Huawei's fast user base and extensive data capabilities to deliver targeted high quality ad content to users. With this service, your app will be able to generate revenues while bringing your users content which is relevant to them. Interstitial ads are full screen ads that cover the interface of an app. The ad is displayed when a user starts, pauses, or exits an app without disrupting the user's experience. Their full coverage is what differentiates them from other ad types like native and banner ads. Now that we understand interstitial ads, let us start integrating and coding. Open and sign in to Huawei Developer website. Go to Developer Console. App Gallery Connect and open My Apps. Click New App and enter the relevant information. Select Add to Project and click OK to create a project. Go to My Projects, select manually until the package name and enter the package name and save. Set the data storage location. And add the SHA-256 certificate fingerprint for your application. Download the AG Connect services.json file. Add the AG Connect services.json file under App Directory. Verify the package name that was mentioned in App Gallery. Go to Android, open the project build Gradle file and add the Huawei Maven repository in repositories. Once it is done, open the app build Gradle file, add Huawei Ads Kit dependency in dependencies and click sync. Go to main activity, initialize the Huawei Ads SDK, add the radio button to choose ad type either video or image, then click the load ad button. Create an object for the interstitial ad and get the ad type ID to choose either video, ad or image ad. Then set the ad callback listener and create ad parameter and load the ad. In ad listener, we are getting the callback on ad loaded where we can show the interstitial ad. We have few more callbacks like on ad loaded. On ad failed. On ad closed. And on ad clicked. And on ad open. Let us try it out. To do that, open a newly installed app and tap on the load ad button to open an interstitial ad in your app. It is possible for you to switch the display form from video to an image using radio button and clicking a load ad. You have now successfully integrated Huawei interstitial ad in your app. Well, that's all for today's episode. If you have any question, you can leave them in the comments area below or visit Huawei developer website and be sure to hit the subscribe button 
and thank you so much for watching